BlackRock amends Ethereum ETF application, Bloomberg's Balchin Assis ETF going live by June. A seed capital investor has purchased 400,000 shares of the proposed filing, BlackRock revealed in its document. Bloomberg analyst Eric Balchin has called the updated S1 a good sign, adding that a launch by the end of June was a legit possibility. On Tuesday, BlackRock became the largest publicly traded Bitcoin fund, flipping grayscale. BlackRock filed an amended S1 form for its proposed spot Ether ETH exchange traded fund ETF that revealed more information about the product that was recently approved for listing in the U.S. The form revealed a seed capital investor had purchased the initial shares for the proposed product. On May 21, 2024, the seed capital investor, an affiliate of the sponsor, subject to conditions, purchased the seed creation baskets comprising 400,000 shares at a per share price equal to $25.0, the S1 form showed. The net asset value of the trust was $10 million. Subject to regulatory approval, assets held in the ETF can be redeemed for cash or even Ether. The iShares Ethereum Trust Ether ETF will list and trade under Ether. Bloomberg analyst Eric Balchin has called the updated S1 a good sign, adding that a launch by the end of June was a legit possibility. The updated S1 comes nearly a week after the Securities and Exchange Commission second approved several Ether ETFs for listing in the U.S., buoying bullish sentiment in the broader crypto market. BlackRock's Bitcoin ETF has proven to be a success so far for the company so far. On Tuesday, it became the world's largest publicly traded Bitcoin fund, flipping grayscale with nearly $20 billion in assets under management. IBIT has taken over $16 billion in net inflows since going in January, as reported with major state pension funds among its investors.